<laughs> yep, yep. Big, big, big. Hold it, I took it off the thing. Look at that! Can you guys see all those mosquitoes? Ah! Oh. All right, this looks like a good spot. Get our weight, make sure everything is set the way we want. Wires in place. Took a stingray going down. A few hundred yards offshore and now we're going back. Shark bait is out. Water is all right today. I uh, just fingers crossed. Got it out about 300 yards, maybe 250. Plenty of line left to spare. I want to say this has about 1,000 yards of line on it total. So it might be closer to 300 with six to spare, give or take. Muhammad just showed up. And he looks like he's brought some serious gear. Oh yeah, we'll get all that. We're just documenting the day. Yes, getting everything rigged up. And what are you aiming for to start? Uh, hopefully some sort of like whiting, sand trout, anything along those lines. I'm hoping to try out that little um, bait dropper. Ah, gotcha, okay. So he's got, he's got a fantastic tool that he's put together that he's trying to experiment with. Uh, so he is, uh, he's going for some small fish, but- Possibly successful, possibly using it in the ocean. We'll see, but you know, trying to think of famous missions where they didn't get the first test back. Probably most of them. You can't beat Apollo, uh, what was it? Apollo what, what, gets that's burned. one is the one, yeah, where everybody burned up. You can't get worse than that, so. But yeah, he's got something he's working on, so he's gonna try to catch some bait, because uh, the mechanism he's built is for dropping baits for sharks. So you don't have to waste 45 minutes with a kayak like I just did. First catch of the day. Was that a whiting? Yeah, that's exactly what I'm going for, so I'm excited. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Yeah, he's floating upside down. Seems like it's still relatively fresh. Oh look, hang on a second, I see something. Somebody caught it uh, and it probably, probably let it die and then threw it back. Which is sad. But, it, I was gonna say, it's yeah. free. Free, like, that's a decent sized ray. Which also means that these only come in when it's like relatively clear, but so do like jacks and stuff like that. I wonder, they probably not. That's cool, hopefully a good sign. So I want to 
try to preserve as much of this ray as possible. He's very strong. Oh. Cut a wing off. Maybe see if we can store him in pieces. Big bit in there. And then these in there. Get him out of the sun on top of a bit of ice. Anyway, let me show you what he's working on because it's really neat. So he has got a little RC drone to hopefully drop the shark baits. Let's see if it's successful. That is cool. So instead of, it's kind of like a... In, using it, like a flying drone, see if I can make something cheaper. So we're going to put flying drones out of business, basically. He's about to own the market for this. But it uh, kind of reminds me what they do in uh, England, uh, in the UK, for carp fishing. They'll have little remote control boats that'll go out and the bottom drops out. And you can place your baits like that. And I do think... That was, uh, when I was trying to research, um, if there was anything like this. So, okay, so the drop mechanism, the line is coming through the board. Yeah, so it comes through and it's up here. Um, and everything is in this waterproof case because I hate making waterproof cases. Right. <laughs> so buy something and then um, just a couple pieces just to have the wires come out. That's really Pretty cool. Simple, but... brought that little ladder so I could stand on top. It's pretty smart. Yeah. All right, I'm feeling it now. Seems like it still works. Awesome. That's success. Yep, yep. Big, big, big. Yep, good fish, good fish. Oof. Yeah. It's good. All right, let's see what we got here. drag can you do me a favor um if this turns out to be a shark there's a sequence of things i want to do real fast um i'm gonna get the rig on my dashboard on the shark tie it to the same rod we used for the boogie board and my phone is in there and that's what i'm going to use to try to get a thumbnail so if this is a shark Rig around the shark first, tie it onto the rod. If you could grab my phone and help me with a thumbnail. Oof. It's 
good fish. I don't know. It could be a red drum though, you know? Yeah. Oh, I saw it. Ah. I think it might be. Woo. Can you see it? I can't tell. I, th I see it, but I, I can't tell what it is. Okay, well, we'll skip all that. Yeah. Woo! Look at you! Ah! Uh. No, 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 no. Dang it! Woo! That's a great fish, man. Can you hold that? Get him back. Ah, oh, what a fish. What a fish. There he goes. Look at him go. And he's off. Time since I've caught a bull red. Also, uh, off the beach like this is really nice. Have you caught anything big on that? Is that one of those? Uh, uh, my kingfish was on it. Uh, it's, it's Spiros. Spiros, yeah. I just I bought one of those, uh, but I haven't caught anything good on it yet. It's it's my favorite reel at the moment. It's incredible. Uh, I was uh, looking for a uh, nice reel with like good drag and. Uh, Water yeah, I, I bought it for like Florida or anytime I'm like on the jetties, but I haven't made any hookups yet. But it's the 1400, yeah, uh, and it's got like 400 yards of braid on it. It's nice, but just untested. Yeah, this one I, ended, I originally this one's a 6,000 size, and for me, I think this is like almost damn near perfect for just yeah. about anything I do. So, I'm that's happy. cool. We all have redfish on the brain now. Um, I, I found the second sandbar. So I, I walked out until I was um, in really shallow water 
and then I, I waited till it got deep again. until I really couldn't see over the waves and this should be fine I think. Ah. Yeah it's nice. He's got to tiptoe back and I get this swept away. So, almost every PB I have, I caught with a storm rolling in. Yeah, I've heard a lot of uh, stories about how they're all like that. Yeah. Howdy, guys. So, oh, sorry, no, I just came over here to see what you guys were throwing out. I was gonna put a cut. I was gonna put a cut lighting out there unless you recommend something else. No, that's exactly what I would recommend. It's crazy. Look at the feeding frenzy. Yeah, it's uh, it's, everything is just screaming fish right now. Just, <laughs> just waiting for a good bite. So, uh, get a piece of lighting out there and kill this guy. Yeah, we've been throwing the heads out and getting some good bites with them. We didn't catch it, but we also, um, somebody next to us caught a really big butterfly ray, like big. So, I mean, there's all kinds of fish out there. God, that's such a, ugh, such a promising sign, all those birds. <laughs> if you guys look out, there's massive, massive uh, flock of birds just attacking the water right there. Oh, I think I might have a bite. Hang on. Good luck. Thanks. I'm hoping we are at the um, the tail end, or the end, not the tail end, the very end, of a, a lull in the middle of the day. So we had really active bites early, and then things kind of died down a little bit, and now there's just birds everywhere. And I've got a few, a few touches here. Yeah, man, look at all those birds out there. That's what you want to see. That's what you want to see. Hold it, I took it off the thing. Huh. <laughs> All right. Um, can you do me a favor? Pinch, pinch the uh, the mallets below. Yeah. That way. Oh, gosh. Woo! All right. That way it won't cut the sound off. My God. Okay, we're still on. Um. Yeah, we'll just have to do that for the moment. Actually, hang on. Can you put it on the the, the uh, gorilla, the gorilla grip in there? Oh, Lord. You got it? No, no, no. Um, here. Use this one. <laughs> you focus on that. Here you go. Okay, perfect. In my car, just, just hit him. He's in the drink holder. <laughs> this has got to be a shark. There we go. 
Um, there. I was gonna say you should be able to see what's on there. I think we're tangled in this other line. Yeah, we are. Crossing over. Yeah. Can you grab that? Um, you see that cross line going off? Here, do you, do you want to point this at him? I need to know if I need to put this rod over it or under it. Over under several times. Okay, like this. Go over and under. Under. Over under. Let me bring, let me bring it over to you. Okay, still there. Okay, you have to go. Bring this line over. This one over. And again. and grab the unhooking point. Let's go back. I can see the hook, so it's not deep. There we go. Somebody hold that light. I know I'm being super complicated. Hold still, hold still, hold still. All right, beautiful shark. That was a team effort. So, the rod went off. Ah. Nearly lost my <laughs> deltoid there. Can you shine it towards the camera real quick? I want to see if there's anything on the lens. Yeah. There we go. Try to get a Dagestani handcuff. There we go. Works on sharks and on people. Beautiful. Uh, I want to say that's a, uh, yeah. Beautiful shark. Fought really hard. Lovely, lovely animal. But everybody helped with that. The rod went off. Lines got tangled, both of my lines got tangled. I had everybody helping me with the lines. I've got multiple people with lights and cameras right now. Really a phenomenal, phenomenal fish. Beautiful to see. Absolutely love these. Let's get him back though, he's been out long enough. Ugh. Thank you. 
but I think he's ready. I just want to make sure he's not going to get tumbled over by any waves. Absolutely amazing fish. Kind of facing into the current. I would check it, the tall one. So, oh yeah, it's slacklining, big time. Take it, take it, take it. Yeah, yeah. See if you can find him. You feel it? I don't feel a fight. Ah, he was, oh, oh. yeah, 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 yeah. Yes. That's the magic. This this rod has, has got all the fish biting today. Yeah. You feel them on there? Yeah, I can definitely. Awesome. Yes. Like, should I have the drag a little bit? Right. It, it's 65 pound braid. I think okay. it should be should be good. That's awesome. <laughs> he should be close. Oh, I see him. He's not happy. Oh, yeah. All right. Um, I might have to do the same thing for you now with the line. No, no. Uh... Let me see where you are. You're just you're just one under. Just go under. There we go. Oh, that's a nice fish. Damn, that is that might be the biggest one I've ever seen. Holy smokes! That is a 
That's a hell of a fish. You want to measure him? Yes. Damn. That's amazing. Okay, I'm gonna go get a. I'm gonna turn the lights on yeah. and get a measuring tape. That is a hell of a big fish, man. That's incredible. That's incredible. Here, take that headlamp off. It won't, won't register you no, if it. that's on. Sorry. <laughs> it's all good. I got your hat. Put it back yeah. on the head, sweetie. Yeah. That's. A... <laughs> wow. That is a nice size red. Hold him out for the camera. You know, you know what I'm talking about. Like towards us. I can't do it. He's way too heavy. <laughs> Incredible. Let's get a measure on him. It's the tape. Oh, even better. Yeah, it's a hell of a fish, man. Is it all the way to the edge? It is. I say it looks like it's like 40 and a half, a little over I 40. I think if you do the, because they allow for the pinching in the end, yeah, you got 41 inch red drum. That's amazing. There's some pliers. That is a stunning fish. There you go. We have to cut it. it. Looks pretty neat. Priority. He'll be fine. I really think he will. Dude, what a fish. That is an extraordinary fish. I'll send you the screenshot from this. Oh, I'm so excited. Thank you so much. Oh man, no, that was all you. Probably deep enough water? Yeah, I think it'll be good. Just if we, we gotta sit with him for a bit. So when you ask the question of whether I'd rather have a massive red or <laughs> an even bigger shark, and I said shark, I think I mean uh, red. There you go. <laughs> he, is, he is very beautiful. goes awesome man that was incredible Thank that's you. fantastic check this out this is the inside of Muhammad's Jeep oh, look at that can you guys see all those mosquitoes ah oh, that's insane no, 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 no. Big fish, big fish. Woo! I'm gonna show you how it's done. Come on, Chuck. That is a picture of a fisherman right there, getting it done. Killing it. The whiting's doing it. I saw some bubble when I was waiting out there. I don't think I think he's I don't think he's on. Oh yeah, he's on. Still there? He was just coming in with him. Oh my god. 
There you go. I'm scared. Oh my God. Now, I'm gonna put this in. Back and forth affair. Oh, it's a shark. I saw his fin right there. You see him? Yeah. No, it might be a redfish, Tim. What are you hoping? If you had your pick, what do we want it to be? Hope we don't disappoint you, man. But my dad wants a harvest one. Oh no, go for it. I, yeah. I was gonna say you. You guys are. Oh, you got it. I don't know, man, because. Shark is easier to clean. <laughs> then I like a big bull red. Yeah. Oh. Let's see how it looks. Wow. Another big one. Man. Maybe a shame. <laughs> oh, a nice set too. Oh, perfect. ¿Estás seguro que lo quieres limpiar? Yeah. That's a nice one. You have your phone, you have your phone, Mohammed? Anybody phone? I can send you a okay. screenshot yeah. from this. Here, let me run and get my phone. So they're deciding whether or not they want to harvest this one, take it in, uh, and in the meantime, we'll keep it in the water just in case, uh, depending on what the decision turns out to be. Your, uh, your headlamp, your picture will turn out better that way. Sorry, do you mind if I wipe? I need to make sure it's strong. That's it. Light. That's it. Try to get it Use the flash of your camera, and I'll put my uh, my light away. You'll get a better picture. Oh, sure, 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 sure. Turn that, put this down real quick. Team, team effort. Team effort. But uh, cleaning it is probably going to be alright. It'll, no matter who caught it, it will taste good at the end of the day. Look at that hook set though, it's not bad. What brand of circle hook do you have on there? Oh, I thought I thought so. Oh, those are good ones. Get a pizza. 
Those have a pretty, yeah. That is a nice fish. Awesome job, guys. Hey, did I give you back your phone? I have it. Oh, okay, perfect. Yes. I'm go put this back. I want to see it real quick. A little. Uh oh, I got one. Got ghost one. crap. Oh. Nice, nice, nice. Just drop the crab. The crab will be fine. Steady, steady. Did you have a steel leader? Yeah, I did. Ugh. I felt like the line snapped. Yeah, I saw the. I saw it go. I think the line snapped because I'm. Ugh. Yeah, line snapped because I'm a terrible fish. Come on. It, it might have very well have been a shark, even their you know their skin will cut line. True. If you don't have like a like a thicker leader material going down yeah, to the my, swivel, my, my braid almost goes straight to the. Ah, uh, oh, okay. Steel. I, didn't have I bet you that's what happens. Yeah. I'm glad they're still biting though, because uh, they slow. Gonna, well, here's the thing: if it doesn't start raining, it's slack tide right now. So I don't know. I'm gonna wait to start moving back up. Oh Whatever yeah. Yeah, one hundred percent. That was a shark's tail. Yeah. Get a close up of that. Yeah, I had a, I had some shock leader, but uh, wow. You feel them on there? Yeah. Yes. So. Round two. Redemption? You're trying to keep me to stay all night. <laughs> <laughs> That's what inevitably happens. My headlamp is dying. <laughs> Cross. I won't get in your way. I just want to catch that if it happens again. Should I have the driver do? No, catch your fish. Whatever it is, when you get him close in, he'll make a panic run for sure, and that'll happen again. Feel some weight to him. Yeah. <laughs> the short. Hey, if his, if the runs are getting shorter, that means you're catching him. Okay, we got a proper fly fly coming over here.
fighting a long time to be a, a red drum. If this is a red drum, he's huge. Oh, the tail is flashing like that. Yeah, that tail is moving. Kind of looks rounded, so I think drum, but. Oh, he's right there, isn't he? Is that not the tail, right? I would expect to see the dorsal. Yeah, I think so. It's a hell of a fish. Yeah, it's a big drum, man. That's a good fish. Let me get the measuring tape and apply it. Look at that. That is a big fish. Hold that. Need help? Yeah. Very nice. I want to get a picture of that one on my phone. I'm gonna run and grab my phone real quick as soon as we get out of the water. Be right back. That's a massive fish. That is by far my biggest red. What do you got? 43. 43 and a quarter. Damn! Quarter. Uh, they have slime on them, and you know, they probably don't want to take them out. Yeah, that's true. Sorry, I got them carried away. Look at the size of that. Big fish. Alright, here, I'm going to get your picture with it. Give me a favor. Get, would you mind with that? And make sure his tail is curving out towards us. That way you get the whole tail in the frame. Awesome stuff. Do me one favor. That'll wash out this picture. There we go. Perfect stuff, man. That is fantastic. Thank you so much. Thanks, man. Instagram now. Tell how big is that? 43 inches. 43. That is definitely a big uh, red drum. I'm sorry. Oh, he's not giving you any time. He says I'm out of here. So you sure we gotta go? <laughs> Phenomenal day. It is almost midnight, but we have been catching bull red after bull red, big sharks, incredible day. So big thanks to everyone on Patreon. Those of you who got to come out, I'm super glad to be able to see you again. Uh, if you're on the Patreon, we do these every now and then. We're gonna do the next one fairly soon. Uh, just by being on the Patreon, you are invited to these things. Um, I will blast out the next location, the next date, next time. Uh, and if you see Patreon Fishing Day, you're invited. Please come out. I want to see you guys again. I want to meet you for the first time. And I want to see you catch some really great fish. More is coming. Let me know what you guys want to see more of. And until then, I have about 10 million mosquitoes to contend with in my car. Catch you guys later.